Welcome to the World Ready Communication Conference 2023, WRC 23 being held here in Dubai in the United Arab Emirates. And we're in our last week and I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio this afternoon by Mr. Stefan Schnorr, who is the State Secretary for the Federal Ministry for Digital and Transport for Germany. Mr. Schnorr, welcome to the studio. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you very much for, for joining us here, for yes, gracing us with your presence. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'd like to ask you, why is WRC 23 important? You've I got a, a, a busy schedule, a busy calendar, I'm sure, but you've taken the yeah. time to be here. Yeah, the WRC is indeed very, very important because we discussed here about spectrum. We, are, but just, we discussed about radio, radio spectrum, and this is very important uh, for all areas of our life. It is important that uh, spectrum is a scarce uh, resource. And we have to use this gas resource very effectful and very e efficient. Yeah? We need it for all parts of our life. The industry needs it. Yeah? We need it for our mobile communication. We need it for broadcasting. We need it for navigation systems. Yeah? We all use navigation systems and we need the spectrum from the satellites. Yeah? We need it for the weather forecast, for example, because also the satellites use spectrum to bring the information from the space to the Earth. Yeah? Ships are needing it, and uh, airplanes need uh, spectrum yeah, for uh, their operation. So this is extremely important. On the other hand, as I mentioned, it is a scarce resource. And therefore, we have to discuss very intensively how can we use it so that all the users can use the spectrum that they need. And this is a very complicated situation, and we have to discuss it not only on national level, we have to discuss it on international level because uh, Spectrum knows no border and therefore we need the cooperation, we need the collaboration between all the states worldwide to find the best solutions and therefore the WIC 23 is very important to know what is the future of the use of uh, Spectrum. Now, you are the State Secretary for the Federal Ministry for Digital and Transport, so there's obviously some uh, interesting conversations going on there. I wanted to ask you, what is the current landscape like for radio communications in Germany? Yeah, it's very important for us here to be on the WRC, and the German delegation is about 60 persons, and we have uh, persons uh, from all the different sectors, so from the industry, from the governments, from administration, but also from academia, because they all have their specific needs, and we have to discuss together with this, let me say, this multi-stakeholder approach, what is the best way uh, to find uh, the best use of this spectrum. Yeah? And therefore, uh, we are working very closely together with all the stakeholders in Germany. And uh, we discuss also during the uh, conference here in Dubai very intensively if we have a pro uh, proposals uh, for uh, the final resolution at the end that we will have uh, on Friday. Uh, and we discuss it together with all the stakeholders to find the best solution that we have clearness for the next four years. I mean, it's interesting because uh, we also have the, the future network car uh, events, which we have uh, quite yeah. regularly as well. So will all of these things affect future network cars and future transportation for, for Germany as well? Yes, absolutely. I think autonomous driving is a very important issue also for Germany, uh, but not only autonomous driving cars. Yeah, We have also autonomous driving trucks for the logistic future. We have autonomous driving trains in the future. We have perhaps also autonomic driving uh, airplanes. Yeah, We have drones at the moment and they uh, also can drive uh, or can fly uh, automatic, yeah? so uh, autonomous. And therefore it is so important that we discuss uh, these issues about the spectrum because we need the spectrum for all these operations. And at the end, uh, the situation in my ministry, Ministry for Digital and Transport, makes indeed sense because the whole transport sector is dominated more and more by digital technology and also by mobile communication, by Wi-Fi communication and all the other uh, things in the, in the future that we will have. So therefore it is so important uh, to combine these both issues uh, together. And finally, let me ask you, Mr. Schnorr, are there any particular outcomes that you would like to see from this World Ready Communication Conference? For us, it is important uh, that we, at the end of the outcome, or at the end of the conference, that we have solutions uh, that are uh, uh, that are relevant for all the stakeholders that are participating, so that all the 
users have for the uh, uh, spectrum that they need and that we find common solutions for all the different sectors on the one hand on national level on the other hand that we have the international agreement and that we and this is also important not only for germany i think for all nations it is also important that we have a little bit of flexibility because we have different needs in every country and uh, we also need uh, to fulfill these uh, special requirements that we have in the future. So common solutions with a little bit flexibility, this is so important for us at the end for this conference. Well, let's hope that you get what, uh, what you're hoping for. We hope so, yeah. <laughs> and thank we you do our best. <laughs> yeah. And thank you very much indeed yeah. for joining us in the studio. Stefan Schnorr, it's been an absolute pleasure having you in the studio. Thank you very much for this conversation. Thank Thanks. you. And if you've enjoyed this interview, which I'm sure you will have, then do check out our other interviews on our YouTube channel, as well as our podcasts on SoundCloud, Spotify, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you listen to your podcasts. And for further information, visit our website at www.itu.int. Thanks for tuning in.